So in this video, you'll learn how to take a scrolling screenshot on your Samsung Galaxy A36. So when it comes to taking a scrolling screenshot, all you need to do is simply start by taking a normal screenshot and then from there you should see an icon on the toolbar. So let's open up our Google Play Store. This is what we're going to be using as an example. If you want to take a screenshot of a whole full web page, then you can just go ahead and open it up. Then ensure once it's opened that everything on that specific page you want to take the screenshot of is loaded so that you don't miss anything whenever it comes to taking the screenshot. Once you've confirmed it's loaded, you then want to again start by taking your normal screenshot, whether you're using the palm swipe gesture, you're using the shortcut in quick settings, or the buttons on your phone, just use any of those three options to take the screenshot. Once you've taken a screenshot, a toolbar will appear with the screenshot listed there. So just tap on this icon here at the first option on the toolbar in order for you to start taking a scrolling screenshot. So screenshot icon and just tap on it once and you'll notice the web page is scrolling down and the thumbnail getting bigger the more you keep tapping on the icon, which is showing you how much of the page is being captured at a time. So keep going until you're satisfied with how your scrolling screenshot is turning out and then you can just let go of the screen and just let it disappear. Or you can just navigate back to the home screen directly. From here, if you want to view your scrolling screenshot, just navigate to the gallery app, and then you should see your screenshot here. And when you tap on it to view the full thing, you should see it's a long page, which means that you've successfully captured a scrolling screenshot on your Galaxy A36. If you have any questions or comments about this process, leave them down below and we'll get back to you.